Hello guys, Drunk Terran here, back with uh, another Pokemon Sun and Moon unboxing. We're gonna go through another full half stack here. Um, so I apologize, I was hoping to get this video out by Wednesday of this past week, but um, you know what, vacation, I went on vacation, which is obviously a great time to restart my YouTube channel. Um, but I went on vacation and um, when I got back I got kind of lazy and I got delayed uh, coming back due to snow. We were in the blizzard. Here's a code to start off the bat. Um, so unfortunately I did not get a chance to film until tonight. It is Saturday the 12th and um, I am excited to get right into this. Um, I did appreciate all of the uh, the comments and love I got on my first two videos, I mean, it was awesome. Ratata and Crab Monster. All right. Um, and that was just like really cool for me. Um, I'm hyped to be doing this. And uh, I've got a lot of ideas for good new content in the future. And uh, so let's uh, let's get right into this. Um, I'm, I was thinking about starting and doing some uh, some other Let's Plays. Um, I play League of Legends. Um, I'm a diamond level player. So if anybody has any interest in that, I'll probably be uh, starting to stream again or just doing some highlights. Um, I'm not really sure where I'm gonna go with that. But uh, you know, for right now, I'm gonna do some more unboxings. Um, there's definitely gonna be one more video of at least one more of Sun and Moon. And then I actually, uh, I was talking to my parents about this. And um, my dad gave me a uh, an old um, Pokemon Jungle, um, a couple of Pokemon Jungle booster packs, um, so that he just happened to have in his uh, Poliwhirl. Ah, this fucking guy again. I've had so, I've gotten so many of those. Um, but yeah, he gave me um, some Pokemon Jungle boosters that he was supposed to give to me and. What, 1998 or 1999? I can't really recall. Um, so I think I'm going to open those up. I'm not sure if anybody even wants to see those, but you know, I figure I might as well if I'm going to open them. Um, I don't have any reason to save them, so I might uh, open them on camera. So that's, uh, that's kind of my game plan for the near future. Um, if anybody has anything that they would like to see, please let me know. Um, I would be more than happy to uh, take any suggestions and comments that you happen to have. Um, I wonder if our luck will be as good with this second box as it was in the first one. Um, we got the one ultra rare. It was a... Uh, um, what was the ultra rare? I can't even remember right now. You know what? I happen to have them right here. Oh yes, okay. It was a Lorantis. That was cool. Here are all my GXs I've gotten so far and the Team Skull Grunt. Um, I think, yeah, actually that is all of them. But uh, hopefully we can add to that stack tonight. That would be cool. So yeah, I've been uh, I've been collecting a little bit more um, just on the side. Not um, Sun and Moon, but just uh, some other... Uh, older packs I just happened to pick up. I was gonna, I picked them up and, you know, to do a video, but I figured uh, I don't really know how many people want to, uh, want to watch me unbox that, or older cards, so, um, if you do want to see that, if you, I, I oh, I just saw something, um, yeah, but if, if you do want to see that, let me know. I might be interested in doing that. Um, I also want to check out the Elite Trainer boxes. I know there are like a million videos at this point. Of both. Okay, here we go. It's shiny. What is it? Gumshoes EX Donald. Uh, what is it? J Trump? Yes. Um, Donald J Trump, the GX edition. Cool. All right. Well, that's a fun start. Um, wow, that's a cool full art. Um, I don't know how good that is. Headbutt, bounce, gumshoe, chance. Huh, that's a cool Pokemon card though. I'm gonna add that to the pile. So we got one, one GX. That's that's pretty neat. I've got a big old stack of uh, um, card, um, what do you even call them? Card, uh, card sleeves. There we go. So 
hopefully we can keep filling those up. And I also have just started um, organizing out my binder. Um, I don't know how long it would take me to get all of the normal set as a reverse, but I thought that would be kind of neat to do. So I'm keeping all my reverses to the side and, um, and I'm just stacking up everything else. Um, I don't know. So right now we've got one hollow and I, I did find out that everybody calls them hollows now, not shinies. So, uh, so I guess I'm gonna stick with hollow. I might, I might throw in a shiny here or there. That's just something I'm used to. Um, you know, leftover from when I was a child. Uh, I mean, I started playing Pokemon when I was, uh, let's see, it came out in what, 98 or 99? I was, you know, I was an early adopter, no big deal. Um, no, I was just, uh, I found out about it and uh, I spent countless hours playing through both Pokemon Red and Blue. Um, yeah, I, you know, I, it was really for a couple of years, it was like one of my favorite things to do. And I made a lot of good friends that I uh, still have today just from Pokemon. So I have to uh, thank Nintendo for that, I guess. Um, I know Game Freak, really, but Nintendo for having the game. Oh, that's cool. That's a neat little hollow right there. Hmm. Put that right there. Um, yeah, and um, let's see. There's something else I was going to cover. I should probably like write this down. Oh, yeah, congratulations to everybody who received codes. Um, it was kind of a hassle getting a hold of people. Um, so right now what I'm going to do is just keep showing them to the camera. Um, I don't have any use for the codes. I don't play the online game. So I think that's a neat little perk just to do a giveaway. Um, but I think at least for this one, if you guys want to give me just some feedback, that would be great. Um, I will, uh, I'll definitely put some of these aside. Um, but like I said, it was just, it was really difficult to get a hold of the people who I selected. I just picked people at random. Um, I gave away 10 additional codes, so, um, hopefully everyone got those and is enjoying them. Um, I don't know. I, I tried the, the, the Pokemon online game, but I just really couldn't, uh, couldn't quite get into it. Um, but no particular reason, but come on. Two cannon. I feel like I have a hundred of these. Um, no particular reason. I just really couldn't get into it. I'm a big play fan of Hearthstone, um, and I you know like other online card games, but I just something about the uh, um, the way that the Pokemon online trading card game was set up. One, two, three, four. Uh, oh, I saw another shine. Okay, let's get to it. Um, yeah, but something just isn't the best. Um, just didn't draw me in. I think it had something to do with the multiplayer. I like multiplayer elements of games and I couldn't really get like deep into it. Another Tauros GX. So that is my first duplicate. Yep. Oh, that's not bad. Let's, uh, I'm still going to throw them in a sleeve and, uh, keep moving from there. A lot of normals, a lot of normal GXs in this set. I wonder if that was done on purpose. Um, and I'm still trying not to spoil um, the cards for myself, and I'm just, uh, I'll set this aside. Uh, I'm trying not to spoil the cards for myself, so I haven't really been, uh, been looking any of them up or anything like that, um, which, makes these a lot more enjoyable when I pull something really cool. Um, another thing I wanted to address, I know it's kind of silly, but uh, you guys might have noticed, uh, I do have a slight, what's uh, it's called a benign tremor. So my hands do uh, tend to shake a little bit, basically. Um, what that means is that the nerves going from my brain down to my hands are actually a little bit too, uh, too short. Um, I found that out when I was about 13. Um, so what happens is the nerves fire for, down, you know, down your, uh, from your brain and, um, and mine fire a little bit too quickly. And what happens is my hands get a little bit of a jitter, which 
is why occasionally you might see uh sometimes it's worse than other times but um wow we only have one two three four four packs left two gx's four packs let's see a, a hyper rare here um but that's why you might see something uh like you know my hands tend to shake up just a little bit um, it can be really bad at some times but when I'm doing these videos I kind of wait until uh, night which seems to help um, which definitely has led to some interesting uh, I remember when I was in college I had to do uh, a public speaking class uh, there's another duplicate um, and uh, and my professor like pulled me aside after my very first speech and kept asking me, oh, why are you so nervous? Why are you so nervous? And I, I had to explain it to him. And honestly, he uh, to start, he did not believe me. And I brought him in a doctor's note because he he, uh, he didn't fail me. He gave me like a C, I think. And, you know, it's like an entry level college class. So you should get pretty much all A's uh, and something like that. You really need to just show up and speak to the class and that's it. And you get an A. So he gave me like a C on my first because because he thought I was extremely nervous, but that was not the case. Man, I'm flying through these, which is great. Um, I might actually film both videos back to back. If not, I'm going to have um, the other one out. Maybe um, I might film it tomorrow night, actually, because I have some other stuff that I want to get done tonight. Um, I'm kind of a night owl, so... I like to get all of my intellectual fun and fun stuff done at night and during the day is uh, work, family, and chores. So that's uh, my schedule. Oh, there we go. We already got the reverse cloister a little while ago. All right, last pack. Um, so yeah, guys, just let me know. Um, let me know what you think. Um, I know I need to work on my lighting as well. Um, I did replace the overhead lights above me, but I, the, I have one backlight that really isn't, I don't think it's bright enough. Um, so just, uh, let me know if you have any issues or thoughts about that as well. Um, and I'm going to probably be getting a different camera at some point. Currently I'm filming on a, uh, one of the new GoPro 5s, but it doesn't, uh, it doesn't quite have the exact colors that I would like it to. Ooh, what is it? Lapras. There we go. That's a cool one to end on. All right. So, um, as with the last set, um, let's see. We got one, two, three on the right-hand side of the box. On the left-hand side of the box, which is what I'm going to open up next, um, that side is the side that I got... Um, my ultra rare on I don't know if that's done intentionally I don't know if that's just the way they package but that might be something to look out for um, if I get a hyper rare on the left side of the box then I'm gonna going to keep uh, testing this uh, theory I guess that I just created so um, yeah thank you so much for tuning in guys I have plenty of codes left but I just don't know what to do with them maybe I will um, give some out if I start streaming. I'll throw them out during my stream. Um, I do have a Twitch account and I've streamed quite a bit in the past. I just, over the last year and a half or two years, I just kind of uh, took a little bit of a break from uploading YouTube videos. I deleted everything off of my channel. Um, and then I actually restarted, I started with a fresh channel just because I uh, didn't want any of my subscribers from watching me play other games to be confused as to why I just start uploading a whole bunch of Pokemon um, videos, which would I don't think it would be an issue for them, but I don't want to bug anybody. So this, uh, right now, for right now, I'm going to keep this strictly Pokemon related. Unless anybody wants to see me um, play some other stuff, you know, I do have a face cam. Um, I, I noticed some a, a few people had commented saying, hey, why aren't you doing a face cam? But, uh that's the reason. So, um, so yeah, I guess that's it. That should wrap up the video. Thank you everybody so much for tuning in. And, uh, as always bottoms up.